Hey, everybody. <laughs> so um, this has been a really interesting morning. This is my last real official morning in the place. I have it till the end of September, but um, I wanted to do a reading here. And boy, has it been a little frustrating. Um, couldn't find my keys. Couldn't find anything. I don't know where anything is. It, and there's nothing here. Right now, Ellie's missing. <laughs> and there's nowhere for her to go. So I feel like there's some message here for me about um, don't believe your lion eyes, okay? Um, because that has been the frustration of the morning that I'm like very much in my 3D persona here, very much in that space. And um, it's like I can't see physically but I can feel energy of, hey, slow down. Hey, take it easy. Hey, it doesn't need to be fast or even good right now. <laughs> it doesn't need to be, and I don't mean that like in a negative way of like things aren't good and stuff like that. But what I'm saying to you is that sometimes when, did you ever see that episode of The Twilight Zone? This is an old show. I apologize to those millennials or whoever is watching who doesn't remember The Twilight Zone. I think I referenced it once before. Um, but there's an episode of The Twilight Zone where these little gnomes live in the future, like 30 seconds in the future. And I see a card from another deck in here, so that's important. Um, from the Barbara Moore deck. Yeah, here you are. Um, Queen of Pentacles. Good place to start. So, um, this episode of The Twilight Zone is about these little gnomes that live like little spirits, little sprites or whatever, live 30 seconds in the future. And they go around moving your stuff. <laughs> they go, they take your keys and they put it somewhere. So even if you just saw them and you turn around and you look back, the keys aren't there. Okay. I got home last night, my car is here, my car is, you know what I mean? Like the keys are here. But sometimes when that energy happens that you need to just slow down, okay? And it's frustrating <clears throat> because you're like, oh my God, I just saw it. So I feel like one of the messages today is about slowing down, is about letting yourself, um, sort of go with the flow a little bit better, okay? Queen of Pentacles is a very nurturing behavior. Take good care of yourself, all right? Taking good care of yourself. Um, being in the, this is being in very much in the physical. This is being very much in the physical. But it's also about um, enjoy, look at the beautiful surroundings. This is from the Barbara Moore deck that I use all the time. This is my first deck. Um, that I've had, it's the first deck I started the channel with, okay? And this table is the, the table on which I did, I want to say 85% of the readings because sometimes I was over there in the, um, in the window. So I'm going to pull a few <clears throat> cards for you today. I will keep going in an extended if you like, if you are so inclined. Um, to follow over there and we're gonna look at what is going on with the journey and right now I do feel like there's a bit of patience grasshopper a little bit of patience and for those of you who are very focused on the relationship this is really very much about you becoming one in yourself okay and <clears throat> the way to remove the waiting is to not wait the way to remove, if you're not, if you're in separation, there really is no way to be in separation because you guys are connected. You guys are one soul. So have you ever asked yourself, whatever the current um, resistance is, whatever the current issue is, have you asked yourself, well, um, how, how I'm looking at this may be part of the problem, how I'm looking at getting over or getting around this, I'm looking at it like a problem. So I'm going to have more problems. If you look at things 
like their problems, there's going to be more problems. Okay. So <clears throat> can you look at it like it's an opportunity? Can you look at it like this is something that is benefiting me? And why is this here? Why is this lesson here? If I just keep trying to get around it and get over it and get through it, um, I, I feel like you're missing a tremendous opportunity right now. Right now, there's an opportunity right in front of you, but you can't see it. You're not seeing it. Remember what I said in the beginning about seeing? Emperor energy here. Magician. Judgment. Six of Swords. Justice. Queen of Wands. Tower. Wow. Page of Pentacles in reverse. King of Swords. Knight of Pentacles. Okay, so what's underneath is this, I'm just going to try to bull through it mentality. I can just force it, okay? There's a, a good book called Power Versus Force, okay? There's this really great um, <clears throat> understanding of, the, you know, it's not the 3D that we need to be concerned with right now. It's not what's in front of you physically that you need to be concerned with right now. It is what is in the etheric body. It is what is in the emotional body. It is what is what is in all of those other bodies that you are. All right. So your your chakras that go all the way up to your crown chakra, your seventh chakra. There are more. There are more above that. Okay. There's more chakras than you than you know than you're currently accessing because you're very much in the earth based mentality right now. And wow, you really have an opportunity here, okay? So magician, judgment, waking up to a new way of being, having all the tools and moving forward. I feel like you are moving forward regardless of what the twin does. The twin is trying to balance themselves. They're trying to reclaim their passion. Tower, we're going to explore this, okay? I have one deck. I have no... Um, other decks with me today. So we're just going to use this one deck. Page of Pentacles. This person missed an opportunity to make an offer. They missed an opportunity. This is not you. This is them. Okay. And so now um, clearing the way, clearing the sights, clearing the path. And Page of Pentacles moves to Knight of Pentacles. Yep, they're slow, but the offer is coming. They are seeing clearly that they missed an opportunity. And it's, it's blowing their mind. Okay, this the tower here. Let's see what the tower is. I feel like some of you could be having twins that are going through separation um, or going through legal separation from someone. They're reclaiming their power, though. Five of Pentacles, King of Pentacles, Ten of Cups, Empress in Reverse. Okay, yes, this person um, left um, a wife, Empress in Reverse. Um, to move toward this Ten of Cups. They may not want a traditional kind of relationship here. Five of Pentacles. They got blasted out um, when you left them behind. Left them behind. Turned your back. This is for those This is for those twins who've sort of, not sort of, definitely getting enlightened. Being Because Magician is very single. Okay? Um, this is what it's like on this plane. Queen of Pentacles. Um, I'm doing my own money. I'm doing my own thing. Your partner here, your twin, King of Pentacles, straight up. So they are still in the 3D, all right? They are still very much in the 3D. They may not know anything about the spiritual connection. Five of Pentacles, they could feel out in the cold that you left them behind. They could feel very um, – they're somehow reclaiming their passion. They're seeing clearly that they have this connection with you. They're still, but this is still, okay, the two queens. I like the two queens here. Justice. They're going to make it right. Yep. Wheel, moving forward, nine of pentacles, <clears throat> moon, and ten of wands. So, they're moving forward into freedom, into more confidence, into independence. All right. 
They are putting down the burdens and the fears of the past. All right, very much putting that down. So they are taking control, taking charge. I like this, I like this, okay? Taking charge, taking control. Ten of Cups, Empress in Reverse. I feel like they don't know how you'll feel. I feel like they don't know how you feel. All right, I can hear you being like, I've told them a hundred times. I think things need to get very clear on <clears throat> how people feel. It's so interesting. This person feels passion for you. Their heart may not have been accessed yet because they're having to go through this other situation. Their heart wasn't on the line. I feel like there's love here. The potential is here. I feel like they're very much controlling themselves, controlling feelings, controlling everything. Um, the feelings were a burden or they felt the feelings were a burden. So they put a hammer on it, put a clamp on it. So they missed an opportunity to make an offer to you. So you moved on into your next phase of life, right? This is the next, this is a new chapter, a new chapter opening here. And they're doing it, but they're going through the tower. They're going through a tower moment. They could have left behind a wife or they could not be sure um, about um, having a wife or having a husband, right? <clears throat> they might feel like there's no love coming from you. They may, they may feel like because you walked away that that means you really don't love them or something like that. But they know, they now get this, what is the, um, let's see, judgment here. Judgment. Three of Swords, Two of Swords, Ace of Pentacles. So I feel like you blocked your heart. You blocked your heart because you were a little bit broken hearted that they didn't make the offer. And so you're moving forward into a new phase of your life. Okay. This person got blown away by the fact that you took some action here. And, <clears throat> excuse me, um, They are going to make an offer. They're getting really clear. This is very, every, all the pentacles are here. The Page of pentacles, knight of pentacles, queen and king of pentacles. All right. And there's also fire here. Aries, Leo, Sag. But it's got to be balanced. Okay. It's got to be balanced. This, um, your twin is <coughs> feeling out of balance by their fears and emotions. They're operating on fear right now. And that is going to bring in the tower because they're not taking action. They're not making offers on the things they should make. And they're resisting their, their twin. They're resisting the divine feminine. Even though they know this is the right person, even though they know you're the right person for them, they're resisting the divine feminine. <clears throat> okay. So I'm going to keep going here. If you want to, if you want to catch the other side of this, there's a link below. <laughs> Welcome to early morning tarot. I know, seriously. All right, link is below for you. Twin flame, they missed an opportunity. What are they going to do about it? Because you're just moving on. You're just like, you know what? This is for this is for those of you in the twin community who's like, you know what? I'm just doing me. Okay, so let's see where we go. Link is below for you. I'll see you on the other side.